please, if you're joining me, do share me. I'm Spirit Medium David Trainer. It's coffee night, so I'm here doing live readings. Remember, if you're here in uh, the Northern Costa Blancas, you can see me live uh, on Monday. Uh, Daniel Watson, my mum and my uncle, hit. Thank you, Daniel Watson. Thank you so much, Daniel Watson. Uh, actually, Daniel Watson, um, would you like to come and broadcast? Daniel Watson, uh, can you come and broadcast with us, Daniel? Daniel Watson, can you put your earphones in and come to broadcast, Daniel Watson? Can you put your uh, earphones in? Are you there, Danielle? Can you put your earphones yeah. in? Yeah, they're in. Hi, love. Oh. oh, are you crying? Hi. Yeah. <laughs> Mom, your mum's fine, I'm, I'm a really bad sceptic. I'm a bad sceptic. I didn't even listen to me auntie told me. The oh, time is amazing. <laughs> She's just told me to say she loves you, Danielle. She's 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 just said I'm Panda. Is she Panda? Yeah, we call her Panda. My daughter calls her Nana. Nana yeah, Manda Panda. Manda Panda, yeah. And she's shown me a panda. She's told yeah. me to say she loves you. It's fine. And she was made up to say to you that she wants you to know she's missed you so much, darling. And she's told me to say she didn't get the chance to say goodbye. And she's with Uncle Daryl. Could he be Connie? Could he be Connie? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She just said, um, yeah. Uh, and would, would there be a little baby that didn't make it into this physical world, miscarried, terminated, or stillborn? My mum did, yeah. I yeah, know. she's brought the little. No. She's brought the little baby forward, your little brother, to let you know that she's got in there. And she's told me to say that she's fine and she's watching. She's told me to say she loves you and she's watching and she's telling me that you've got... She's very proud of you. She tells me that you're going through a bit of a difficult patch, but she tells me you've also been doing well in what you're doing, but you've been going through a little bit of a difficult emotional patch. You know yeah. this, don't you? Yeah. And she tells me that she knows you felt let down and hurt, but she doesn't want you to be hurt. She's watching. And your nana and your auntie has been fabulous with you, she's just said. Is that right? Yeah. And she tells me that you've been, you've been a bit right. depressed. She told me you've been a bit depressed. And you're looking, you, you, you're contemplating looking to move house, aren't you? You're talking about moving house, yeah. she tells me. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. And she tells me that I am. You, you didn't, you didn't, you, you felt now you've got to go because the walls are reminding you how unhappy you've been. Yeah. And now you've been let down, your mum's telling me. Is it right, though? Yeah, Finn's on point. She told me to Remote. say to you. It's she mad. Just me, she just told me to say, I love you. She just said, Dave's real. Me and Uncle Daryl, <laughs> fine. Aren't we, Connie, love? We're fine. And would you Uncle have took his own life, love? Would no, well, yeah or no. Yeah. He, um, he went out on a night out and um, ended up taking too much stuff and died. So it's classed yeah. as accidental suicide. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. He's just, told me to say to <laughs> He's just told me to say to you that he wants you to know he's proud of you and he's sorry that you've been so troubled and things have been such a mess. <laughs> And he's just said, I Can love I you from my soul. I, I love you from your <laughs> soul, love, he's just said. Your mum's just said, I'm really, she just said, I'm really made up to be doing this. You know, David, my me sister's too. been trying to talk her into doing it for ages, and she wouldn't. She wouldn't. She thought yeah. you were fair. Is that right? 
Yeah. You're talking for Claire. Yeah, well, it's Heather Podmore. I was talking to her today time. about it. Just, this is the first time that she's done anything like this. And I just want her to know it's real and I'm missing her from my soul. <laughs> and she's just said to say to you that she hears you talking to her. And <laughs> she just wants to know you were talking to her the other day when you were upset because of what had gone on and you'd been falling out <laughs> and you were saying if my mum was here she'd be around me. It's right that isn't it? Yeah. Showing me that you, you went upstairs and you sat on the bed crying. You went upstairs and <laughs> sat on the bed crying the other day. I think that could be Monday. Yeah. And she tells me that she sat on the bed at the side of you and put her arms around you, but they went straight through you because she, because she's a spirit and you're a physical. <laughs> but she wanted to know, she knew it what had gone on prefix the weekend and everything and all the hassle and trouble you've had with a certain somebody. And she tried to put her arms around you and told me to say to you, she loves you. She would never, ever, never leave you. She just said, I'm losing my you. skin. <laughs> Losing my skin won't stop me from loving you, love. It just won't do it. She just said, you're my little girl. <laughs> now, <laughs> she just said, I'm, she just said, I'm just not going anywhere. She just said, all right. She just said, Thank you, very much. you just keep your chin up. She just said, you just keep your chin up. See your way through. She just said, I feel you're doing the right thing, moving. She just said, because you can't. You, she just said, you can't carry on like this. And who, somebody who you've been with has been treating you not how they should do. <laughs> and has brought Sorry. your heart. It's brought your heart. <laughs> and they've not told you, they've not been honest with you, she tells me, your mum tells me. And she tells me she doesn't like that. <laughs> she's just said, I don't like that. She's just said, it's not fair to her, David. She doesn't deserve this. She doesn't deserve any of this situation whatsoever. She's just said, listen, I'm putting my arms out for you. And she's just said, and you just leave him now to where he belongs. She's just said. <laughs> Get it? Thank you. Now, Thank can you I just much. say... I need to just say something to you, Danielle, okay? Nick Archer has wrote up here. He's doing research on people's profiles. Would I be right in saying to you, I've not looked at your profile and there's none of that I could know on your profile? I don't put my private life on Facebook. Nick Archer, you are desperately wrong and ought to be ashamed of yourself. I Can I just say I'm to a bad, bad skeptic until now. Are you? Are you? Yeah, I didn't believe any of it. I was speaking to my auntie, Heather Podmore, who's on here, and she spoke to her about Connie and Panda. And I've been speaking today, and she said to go on the live today, and I have, and they've come through. It's amazing. <laughs> Can I just say to you, have you been having problems with that property? Because she tells me that it's not in a good state. <laughs> For the money, yeah. is that right? <laughs> and there's damp up the wall or something, and it keeps it's it, it's not correct that property for the price you've been paying. Is that right? Yeah. And she tells me she thinks bad. that you're better moving on now. She tells me it just feels a very negative time for you, and it's time to pull yourself together and move on. Are you all right with this? Yeah, everything's everything's fine. Have you have you been <laughs> feeling a bit like down with your father? He's dead. <laughs> yeah. He have died you been feeling... eighteen months ago. Did, uh, did you feel a bit like down with him before? With him. Ah, that's it. I've got yeah, your father I didn't have no with him. Your father wants to Whoa. say to you, "Sorry for letting you down." <laughs> He didn't get the chance to say goodbye to you. And he wants you to know 
He wants you to know that he didn't get the chance to say goodbye to you. And he feels he's let you down in life and he apologises. He's made amends <laughs> with your mother. He's made amends with your mother. That is crazy. I've not had any contact with him for years. He's made amends with your mother. He's not saying that he's with her. He's just made amends with her. Okay? Oh, that's good to know, and he wants you to know, he wants you to know, he will never, ever, ever, ever be happy until when you're old and you move over to the afterworld and he apologises <laughs> to your face. Okay? And he's just said, yeah. I absolutely, I absolutely am so sorry, Dave. He's just said, she didn't deserve how I was. I let my family down when she was young and it was the wrong thing. That he just said. And he's just said to me, to you, uh, uh, a man, man, he's just said, did a great job. Uh, and he just said, but it was just awful. Man did a great job, but it was just awful how I was. And that's what he's just said. Now, do you understand that gentleman? Yeah. That's him, isn't it? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, I'm crazy that. I've not had no contact with my dad since I was four years of age. He's just told me to say to you that he wants you to know from his soul, okay, that he is there for you. Now, I'm going to say something to you, Danielle. Thank okay? you. I'm going to say this. Life's not built on tears. It's built on celebrating that life is continuous. So I would say to you, the best thing is now is dry up your eyes. Know your mum shed a skin, but she's not a moment away from you because that's how would I know that information that she's passed to me, which has all been accurate, correct? Yeah, spot on. And she wants you to know that. And she's just said, look after yourself, love. She's just said, really, look after yourself. I'm watching. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Are you all right with him? Are you yeah. all right? I'm baffled. Yeah. <laughs> you what? Yeah, but everything was spot on. I said, I'm baffled. I said, I'm coming. I've had contact since it was off. Crazy. I'm just, I'm just glad <laughs> that everything has been happy for you. All right. And uh, I'm Thank glad you very that much. they've come to you. Take care, my darling. Me too. Look after yourself. Thank All you very right. much, and I'm definitely a believer now. <laughs> Thank Take you. care. Bye-bye, darling. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. 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 And that was lovely, Daniel.